Welcome back to our channel, the channel for the latest news and stories about Catherine, the Princess of Wales. Today, we bring you news. Catherine stole the spotlight in a stunning braless fashion statement as she shocked world fans. Princess Catherine tends to dress conservatively. The Duchess of Cornwall and Cambridge has been known to occasionally go braless. The trendsetter never fails to attract attention with her exquisite sense of style. Whether it's an old portrait from the beginning of her relationship with Prince William, or merely a low-cut gown to wear to a star-studded occasion. When Catherine wore a black and white strappy gown during the opening of Top Gun Maverick earlier in May 2022, she turned heads. Her body-hugging Roland Murray outfit had been on full display when Tom Cruise, one of the movie's stars, brought her to speak for the remaining members of the group. Star Jay Ellis told, The opportunity to meet the royal couple was completely incredible, as well as the rest of the group of actors was similarly effusive after the occasion. The British royal family are regularly seen at numerous film premieres throughout the years, so this is hardly the first. At UK openings of the Hollywood blockbuster, the pair is frequently pictured suited up to the nines and holding hands alongside the stars. Her fashion selections at these as well as other occasions have consistently garnered media attention throughout the years. Catherine's rather understated style has been observed by many. Numerous makers have publicly commended her taste in clothing. A princess's beauty ought to be alluring. Roberto Cavalli, for one, told British Vogue in the summer of 2013 that she seems young at heart, she's gorgeous, and I would love to generate something unique for her, but something too outrageous. I want to show everyone that Roberto Cavalli is worthy of dressing as a royal. Perhaps I could combine it with a printed matter, maintaining a sense of modern and sultry. You don't have to give up your sexiness because you're regarded as royalty. However, I think that we're all in agreement that Catherine has consistently displayed throughout the years, and particularly in her breathtaking braless appearances, that she possesses a rare combination of sophistication and sexiness. Here, in a rare gallery appearance, you can see the Princess of Wales addressing a function sans her trademark bra. Let me bring you a more seduced moment of Princess Catherine through the time with them braless fashion statements. It will make you never regret. Time for a v-neck. Catherine wore a vibrant red v-neck outfit on the 17th of June 2006 to stay cool. Catherine attended Prince William's polo match in a sunny polka dot neckline attire. Elegant raffia heels as well as a snip in her hair from Chavaractory Cup Foundation for the tournament of the Polo Club near Richmond, England. Polka dots mimic the dress's design. During 1981 opening of For Your Eyes Only, Princess Diana wowed in a substance that was a red polka dot dress. The little back of her dress made an impression. Princess Catherine was observed in the very beginning of the 2000s frequenting London clubs with an assortment of pals prior to her April 2011 wedding to Prince William. She wasn't planning on going out to turn heads with her clothes, but they quickly became the subject of conversation of the city. The couple, then dating, went out to a Chelsea nightclub in September of 2005, when the princess turned heads in a straightforwardly seductive black v-neck and about knee-length dress. Just for a moment, a timeless fashion masterpiece that will continue to resonate on forever. No bra, your majesty. Princess Catherine wears sheer gowns without a bra to the Bond film premiere. Wow, during the London screening of the new Bond film, Princess Catherine eschewed her usual modest princess attire in favour of a risque selection. A translucent gown worn without a bra. She stunned wearing a Jenny Packham and soft blue hue. However, she neglected to accessorise with any lingerie. The backside of the floor-length gown had to be see-through, as the sleeves as well as revealing that Catherine was not even bothering putting on a bra. The draping style also exposed some skin thanks to a plunging v-neck. Strictly in love, Catherine does not play it safe every time she takes off the bra. Catherine wears a brilliant green Jenny Packham outfit that had been created especially for her to a dazzling state supper. The garment is rumoured to have been a one-of-the-kind take on Miss Packham's Wonder Glitter Tully Brown. 
She accessorized it with a piece of jewelry and earrings of emeralds and diamonds on loan from Her Majesty. Catherine has been seen in the UK at the latest trend labels, creations prior to this, and the likes of Angelina Jolie, Jennifer Lopez and Taylor Swift are devotees. In October of last year, she intended a screening of No Time to Die, wearing a stunning gold gown from the designer. For the princess and prince's recent trip to Jamaica, Catherine wore a sparkling Tully gown accessorized with magnificent jewels on loan from the Queen. The GCVO star and the members of the Royal Order were also visible on her. Direction to the Risky Areas she risked a sneak peek in the opening scene of the Top Gun Maverick. Catherine's off-the-shoulder dress for the Top Gun launch caused quite a stir, and Catherine's Roland Murray Lambeau gown was the topic of conversation of the town. The gorgeous pillar dress had an off-the-shoulder white collar and an upper layer of stretch crepe that clung to her curves in a figure-flattering black. Regrettably, for what would be imitators, the evidence suggests that frugal Catherine is up to her old tricks again. This garment is a piece from the creator's archive that dates back many seasons, and Catherine probably had it in a closet for quite a while. The mother of three complimented her outfit by carrying a 2019 Alexander McQueen beetle box purse. She accessorized with a pair of Robert Pelham dropping star studded with diamond earrings and a pair of Prada heels with a sweeping wave cutout. An elegant bombshell. She converted a tame blue blazer outfit into a seductive outfit. The royal family, led by the Princess of Wales, will be wearing blue forget-me-nots at the altar of the garter. Catherine Walker's signature fit and flair style was on full display for the Princess of Wales, who donned a vibrant forget-me-not blue overcoat suit. The Princess of Wales topped off her all-blue look with a fascinator by London milliner Juliette Botterill a ruffled handbag, and an assortment of aquazura slingback heels featuring a small embellishment at the back of the foot in place of her typical court-high heels. Catherine also donned the shape like a sapphire as well as diamond necklaces, along with studs that matched her marriage proposal ring, which was assigned to Princess Diana. The deceased princess favoured Catherine Walker, the creator of her dresses, and often donned them in public events until her sad loss in 1997. Thanks for watching today's video. Is the trend towards bravery clothing one that you approve of? Do you hope to see similar clothing choices in the future? If you have any last thoughts or comments, please share them with us.